SPI has been pushing for this study for five years and we're delighted that the National Academy has set up such a strong team to undertake this study and we're in constant uh, dialogue with the co-chairs of the study, Alan Wilner and uh, Paul McManaman, a past president of SPIE. We uh, encourage all of our membership to actually contribute to the study give their opinions, their ideas, their concerns, and so on. Because it is, a, as in all these things, it's the greater body of knowledge that hopefully the study will be able to distill down. But if people are not willing to actually engage at this process for input for the study, then a, I suppose it makes it more difficult to legitimately criticize the outcome afterwards if it's not to their satisfaction. We certainly hope to see a number of our members attend a, one of the open sessions that the committee is holding, the one at our optics and photonics meeting on Monday night. And a number of the National Academy committee will be there to take input, to listen, to hear what uh, the community or this segment of the community has to say. And we're constantly seeking other ways for the broader community to really be able to contribute their ideas, their thoughts, their knowledge to what we hope will be another outstanding National Academy study on the promise of optics and photonics.